Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to a brand new YouTube video and this is a very uh, highly anticipated video that I've had to make and I've wanted to make this video for so long. I've talked about every Resident Evil leaked game up to this point but I want to talk about this one in specific. Um, I'm a very big fan of this game. It is probably one of my top five Resident Evils. I beat it last I think two Christmases ago, so two years ago I beat it, and honestly I was left with wanting more, and I really do love Leon as a character, and I just loved him in Resident Evil 2 Remake, and just playing as him as a character, just, ah, uh, he's such a badass, but that's not what we're going to be talking about in today's video, we're going to be talking about Resident Evil 4 Remake. Now we're going to be going over most of the information that we do know, and let me keep you guys in the loop with this. Uh, I'd say this in every video, but I do want to keep this very, very importantly. Um, everything is subject to change. Take everything with a grain of salt, but these are this is coming from a lot of reliable sources. I will leave my sources in the description for this video. Um, but other than that, guys, let's just get into this video. Oh, yeah, if you guys do go on to enjoy it, drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new, and let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Uh, let's talk about it and let's just talk. Yeah, but so the same studio that brought us Resident Evil 2 Remake and Resident Evil 3 Remake, Dev 2 or M2, I'm sorry, they were in they were in charge of the project, but they were re, they were they have now been reduced and you know they are really upset about that and this is all coming from leaks by the way so division one or the main capcom studio is taking over development now from what we've heard they want to add a lot more things and things that weren't in the original and i'll keep my opinions for later but they want to add a lot more things apparently claire is going to be in the game which is some um, crazy crazy information i mean having claire in resident evil 4 uh it wouldn't really make sense but i mean it's 2021 i i can think of multiple ways they could add it into it apparently it's supposed to take place in between or not in between it's supposed to have connections to resident evil infinite darkness that new netflix show and um it's also supposed to have connections to resident evil village and uh, Resident Evil Village takes place in like 2020 or 2019, I can't remember. Uh, so that's a lot of years, you know. <laughs> but if they can find some way to, you know, like tie in the game, I mean, that would be pretty sick, you know. Um, I hope it's more horror based, the game. I don't want it to be too action packed. I already said my opinions, but I don't want the game to be too action packed. That's something I just don't want to see. I mean, obviously, having a lot of action in the game is, is good, you know. It, it strikes a perfect balance between horror and action. But I would like to see this game more horror based because that was one thing that I didn't like about Resident Evil 4. I thought it wasn't horror based. Like I was scared sometimes, but I mean, let's be honest, it's an action game. But I would like to see the better controls. It's going to be third person. It's going to be releasing. It was supposed to be released in 2022, but it's going to be releasing in 2023, apparently. And in between that, it's supposed to be releasing with Resident Evil Outrage, Revelations 3, essentially. Um, we're also supposed to be seeing Ada Wong, uh, the uh, that the president's daughter character. I can't remember her name. Um, Ashley. Ashley. I'm sorry. Uh, we're supposed to be seeing Ashley back in the game. And uh, we're also going to see the actors from Resident Evil 2, like the newer models for Leon in this game. Apparently, Leon's supposed to have a beard. Uh, apparently, I think that's a leak too. Um, there's a lot of miscellaneous information that isn't really important, but I mean, it's, it's still like there. But um, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much all the information that we needed to gather. Like, let me recap. So, it's supposed to, it was taken, it was being developed by one of the side branches of Capcom, and they were it, the game's been in development since 2018 alongside with resident evil village and also outrage but again this game uh, has been delayed well obviously we don't have concrete information has been delayed but they wanted to add more stuff to the game essentially um and that's why they most likely are taking a little longer because m2 wanted to stay original to, or just wanted to keep the story original you know stick to the game the original as 
much as they could but no i think capcom wants to innovate and you know make the game better and of course with that they're gonna add claire maybe claire is gonna lead into resident evil infinite darkness 2 or maybe she's gonna be some in some sort of capacity but again we don't know but the game is slated for 2023 to 2024 release um again the game's been in development i imagine that they're polishing it up right now i mean that's my main guess because they, from the sounds of it the game is complete but only time will tell now that's pretty much all the information we do know about the game guys if i did miss anything let me know in the comment section below if i did miss anything i will let you guys know in the comment section below um but other than that guys i mean that's gonna have to wrap up today's video hope you guys definitely did enjoy and i will catch you guys in the next video Peace out, guys.